I be now, all is now, it's a gift to be in the present. Fresh sage signing back in here, putting out my perspective into the cloud of the collective to expand the collective consciousness. You're now tuning into the mind of an allogenic moon, and it is Taurus slash it's Taurus hours as I make this video. And this is going to be your sun and moon transits. Okay. So with this, this is moon and Taurus, sun and Capricorn. So we are officially in Capricorn season, okay? As I make this video, this is fully in Capricorn season. No cusping Sag. This is fully in there. You know, it's in that zero degree type shit. You know, so it's the winter solstice. All right. So basically, it's dealing with which is Capricorn is being ruled by Saturn. Okay. So this is more of being more restricted so you could you know have more you see you'll see more restrictions you know at this time you know to certain actions you know because you know let's say we got this is a uh, like let's say whoever you, let me give you like an example where we talking about christmas shopping you know, it's like, it will be like a late, you be, if you're Christmas shopping at this time, you will be, you will be like late because, you know, their so-called Christmas is on the 25th type shit, you know, so it's more restricted, you know, this energy is more like restricting, you know, so it's, and it's basically basically standing on business like you know like being about your business and you know utilizing you know like i said like previously in a video <clears throat> utilizing whatever knowledge and wisdom and expansion you gain from the previous seasons aka sagittarius to basically uh, ac accumulate to your status, you know, and yeah, to add to your status because at this time, basically, this is this is the the mid heaven, you know. So Capricorn rules the mid heaven, which deals with status in your career. So you know, is basically you can basically add, you know, just accumulate whatever knowledge and wisdom you acquired from pr the previous season, you know, you would just accumulate this into this new season. <clears throat> so, Moon and Taurus, Sun and Capricorn. This is a trine, aka the 120 degrees. So, moon being in Taurus, being exalted, uh, being exalted in Taurus, moon is like, uh, exalted in Taurus. So, meaning emotionally, we react and respond to you know things that are are pleasurable to us at this time, you know, so we want to react and respond, you know, react and respond to Taurus type things, you know, so like anything that we can find value in, you know, so, but reacting and responding to, you know, Capricorn type things, so, you know, we have this gift, you know, to, it's a, it's a earth, hold on, is there a, yeah, there's a, yeah, there's damn near a, a, a earth, a grand earth trine going on right now with, 
Yeah, there's a lot of planets in in Earth. So, you know, it's a uh, it's gonna be based based off of you know making sense and being practical at this time. You know, so uh, you know the gift. So the Taurus, the the gift we have at this time with Capricorn and Taurus is basically being able to you know utilize whatever utilize whatever you know house we got Taurus in and whatever house we got Capricorn in okay whatever house whatever house you got uh Capricorn and Taurus you know that's that's gonna be playing out as you know uh, the opportunities and stargates that that can we can we can basically open to uh have this to have a business or you know or like whatever whatever you're trying to manifest because earth deals with manifesting and materializing so so we materialize when when we got sun and when we got earth in the sun and in the moon you know is it basically has this it basically has this slowed effect where Things you you basically wanna take take things step by step. We don't we barely got any Virgo there. There's no we don't we only got Virgo and Black Moon Lilith, but you know it's basically Taurus and Capricorn at this time. So it's basically having this patience for whatever you wanna manifest in whatever career you wanna acquire. Okay, and basically seeing seeing it through you know working you know having this steady approach towards you know whatever uh status you see yourself you know you have this gift at this time you know to basically yeah to have to for this the opportunity a gift opportunity to basically, you know, manifest and, you know, materialize. And that moon is also conjuncting Jupiter and Taurus as well. Yeah, that moon is also conjuncting Jupiter and Taurus.